So there's people online that are saying that this Donald Trump, uh, what happened to him was somebody using the un and pop, 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 pop over and over again while he's on stage. And a lot of people are saying this is stage. They already got pictures out of him with a fist pump, got blood on his face, and all these Republicans saying they try to take him out. They, they try to end him. They try to prevent him from getting back into the White House, and that's the narrative. Now they got this Rocky theme going on in that regard. So there's people that are thinking that, and the other side, people are thinking like, wow, somebody really tried to take this man out. But it just was weird. It was a weird sequence. It was weird out of, all of a sudden, it's just his rally, calm, cool, collected, and all of a sudden he's saying, oh, I'm going to show something, and then all of a sudden you hear somebody ringing off shots, and then, you know, he just gets down, and it just seems like a ton of seconds pass by before even a Secret Service can even get in that area and jump on top of him. It just, I don't know. It, it, it looked kind of suspect. But, um, you know, they're already running with that narrative, and just think about how much the media has made off of Trump. I mean, if you ask how much CNN has made off of Trump, Fox made out of Trump, off of Trump, Newsmax, MS, NBC, I mean, they've probably made billions off of that man. Um, and it's really there, there, don't matter where they side they're on, Democrat, Republican side, they know that this is must see TV and they care more about ratings. These, these companies, once you're going to learn one day, these companies don't care nothing about the people, all they care about is their bottom line. They are a business, they are a company, and they are selling a product, which is media, and their goal is to keep people as tuned in as possible to their station. And this right here is a gold mine for them because usually stuff don't really happen on the weekend. So they're going to have this going from today all the way to the next coming weeks, and it's going to be even included um, in this election cycle. So... Just it's just showing you. You got the narrative that Biden is someone that just can't even keep his eyes open. He's he's just not. He doesn't have the cognitive uh, ability to be up there. Then he was saying, "Well, you got Trump, who people are saying, you know, at the rallies that he lied and he didn't say any real truths." So that's what we're up against. And then we're like throwing in another um, storyline of they try to take him out. So to me, I just think this is all weird. I just think this is all crazy. I don't know if it's real or fake. And that's the thing about stuff being on TV, stuff that's being being presented to you. You don't know if it's, you can't, it's getting to a point right now where fake is looking real and real is looking fake. So sure, more stories going to come out of this of what happened, but a lot of people think it's staged and a lot of people think it's real. What are your thoughts?